Hi guys, this is Abi from Gokche DB, and in this video, you're going to learn how to swap environment URLs in AWS Elastic Beanstalk. Let's get into it. Let's start by navigating to the Elastic Beanstalk service, then click on Create Application and give it a name. Choose Python from the platform dropdown, then select upload your code. I'm going to grab this sample python.zip file from this AWS developer guide, upload it, then hit create application. Give it a few minutes for the environment to come up, then hit refresh to check the status of your application. Click on your application's hyperlink and you should see a congratulations message which means your application is now up and running. Next, let's uncompress the python.zip file and edit the application.py file in a text editor. I'm going to search for the congratulations header and add the word beta right after it. Save this file, then create an archive.zip file by compressing these three application files. Let's head back to the Elastic Beanstalk window and click on the Actions dropdown and then hit Clone Environment. I'm going to call this environment Beta App, then scroll down and click on the Clone button. Give it a few minutes for the new environment to come up, then refresh this page to check the status of your application. Click on the beta application's hyperlink and confirm that the new application is up and running. Next, click on upload and deploy and upload the archive.zip file that we created in one of the earlier steps. Give it a few minutes for Elastic Beanstalk to update our environment. Then click on the beta app's hyperlink to confirm that you see our changes on the web page. Now that our beta environment is stable and looks good, let's see how we can swap URLs with the prod application. Navigate to the prod application's environment page, then click on the actions dropdown, then hit swap environment URLs. Choose the beta app from the environment dropdown, then click on the swap button. Give it some time for Elastic Beanstalk to update our environment, then click on the new prod apps URL and it should point to the beta environment. If you scroll down to the recent events, you can see that the Route 53 C names for our environments were successfully swapped as well. You can also confirm this by going to the beta applications environment page and see that the URL is now pointing to the prod app. There you have it. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment section below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell. Until next time.